Auckland is the base for the Trans-Tasman Air Service, which runs eight trips a week to Sydney with the big 30-passenger flying boats. At the company's headquarters in Mechanics Bay, tomorrow's plane is at the pontoon, its motors being checked for the flight. When the big planes waddle out of the water for their yearly check, they go up the harbour to Hobsonville. With wheels on, they're trundled into the hangar by a tractor. Men swarm over the big aircraft. Every part is examined and checked and given a polish. Engines go back to Mechanics Bay for their checkover. All the parts of an aeroplane engine, every part examined and measured and carefully gone over. parts go together, every assembly is examined to make sure it's right. Examiners even measure the stretch of a bolt to check its tension. As complex as an aeroplane engine is the rest of the organisation. Instrument repairers for altimeters and revolution counters and automatic pilots. Doctors examinations for air crews every six months. A navigation school and a link trainer with every pilot getting blind flying instruction every month. Briefing on weather conditions for the next day's flight. An area of high pressure here, avoid a disturbance there and all the office work and checking and bookings and in reply to yours of the fifth and yes madam we have two seats and the careful weighing of freight and baggage. There are clerks and typists and chiefs and chefs. Chefs who prepare the meals to be eaten 6,000 feet over the Tasman. Chefs and stewards who check the salad and aspic, the ice cream and chicken, who check everything that goes into the plane. 90 knives and 90 forks and 60 spoons, all to be checked. Checking the motors, checking a reconditioned engine in the test house. Start it up and run it for an eight hour check. Eight hours of this, a full throttle test before the engine goes into a plane checking the oil pressure and the boost, the temperature and the revs. One million revs to Sydney, and it mustn't miss a beat. 6,000 feet over the Tasman, eight hours over the clouds.
Zebra Mike Baker to Rose Bay launch. Zebra Mike Baker to Rose Bay launch. Request landing instructions, please. Over. Some people, this is the biggest city they've ever seen. To some, it's just dropping into another collection of buildings and hotels, appointments and contracts. third city of the British Commonwealth, Sydney has as many people as the whole of New Zealand. More traffic, more noise, bigger buildings and greater crowds than anything over the Tasman. For today's passengers, the trip is over. In the morning, the plane is starting back over the Tasman, leaving the bays and the big buildings, the bridge and the two million people. 1,300 miles to New Zealand, eight hours to Auckland.